Harvey Nanninger, a pioneer in the study of meteorites. His persistent research and fieldwork moved the study of meteorites from a naturalist's hobby to a scientific discipline. I knew there were asteroids that were circulating between Mars and Jupiter. And there must be, from what I could learn, there must be millions of them. And I was sure that occasionally they must have bumped into the Earth. And that in doing so, they would become a force in geology. Now, that I'm not so much interested in the eight or 15 or 20 that have been seen to cross the orbit of the Earth in the last few decades. What I'm interested in is what has gone on before this. If this has happened in 30 or 40 years, what's happened in 30 or 40 million years? Would there be 18 or 20 million of them that have crossed the orbit of the Earth? And did they all miss the Earth? While we were talking, suddenly the sky just split wide open, a fireball uh, like which I've never seen before or since uh, came down and I, I was so full of the subject I had been thinking the last few weeks, I reached in my pocket and got hold of a crayon and I marked a place on the sidewalk. He said, what are you doing? I said, I'm, I'm going to try to find that fellow. And he laughed. He said, you, you think something came to Earth? Yes, I think so. I feel sure of it. Well, where? Well, I said, you saw where it, where it disappeared, didn't you? I said, somewhere out in that direction, about 150 miles from here. And then he laughed again. He said, I know now you're kidding. I said, no, I'm, I'm serious. <laughs>